Welcome to the Harmonic Pattern Collection for Ninja, Ninja Trader. I wanted to go through a quick preference setting for scanning for patterns. Now, there's a bunch of different patterns you can look for. You can look for the ABCD, the Gartley, the Bat, the Butterfly, the Crab. Uh, I like to look for individual patterns at times. Uh, a lot of times take a look at just Bat patterns or Crab patterns. But an excellent and real basic pattern to scan for, uh, even generally now and then to be aware of, basic ABCD structures. So if we go into the harmonic pattern collection, we right click on the chart, we're going to click the indicators, and that's going to get us to the harmonic pattern collection settings. Click that, highlight that, everything that all of our preferences and, and uh, different tolerances that we can set are located in this menu box. Now the thing I want to focus on right here is the harmonic pattern scanner part itself. And we can change this a number of different ways and this can be saved uh, as different scan files. But for this purpose let's just look at setting up the scan for ABCDs. So we want to click that, just double click or you hit the drop down menu and select true. And then we're going to turn off the other patterns, the bat, by clicking that false. These are all OK, and then showing the pattern account is just showing the labeling. So everything else is set up pretty standard. Um, the only thing that you might want to consider is that the maximum bars that looks back, this is the number of uh, bars. No matter how far or how much little data is displayed on your chart, the pattern scanner We'll, we'll go through all of the data available if you limit this, if you don't limit this. So a lot of times the setting is on infinite, and that means it'll scan everything. I suggest putting it on this 256. That's basically, we'll go back over the past 256 bars looking for pivot points for pattern creations. And that's going to be uh, a lot easier, and it's going to be a quicker scan. Uh, you'll be able to uh, find a lot more matches that way. So we'll hit Apply, and we come up with these ABCDs. That was pretty quick. But even with this, now we see on the daily chart here, we're looking at British Pound, US Dollar. A couple of key patterns that we might not have seen had we not scanned for this if we were just looking for more complex patterns. And currently, right now, we have a very interesting ABCD that's uh, just completed recently, especially with all the volatility after the Brexit announcement. I find this pattern really interesting. I think this is something where, uh, according to Harmonic Pattern Collection, right down at 130.23, that ABCD, that simple structure, is a key area for support. Uh, and then we see actually some even smaller uh, ABCD patterns that linked up pretty well. Here's a small consolidation ABCD structure. And that's uh, these are great patterns, even if just for short-term reactive moves. But the market responds really well to the most symmetrical, the most distinct ABCDs. This is pretty uh, a pretty sweet setup. This is very distinct. Um, great ratio structure. The ABCD itself completed up at 146.85 and then the high right there on the daily chart was right at above 147 and then that was good for a 300 pip move. Just off that initial reaction and then look what happens. The secondary retest comes up for those that know harmonic trading type 1 retest, uh, type 2 test um, we form another ABCD off that secondary test. Now this one sets us up with a nice zone right down here with the ABCD always being the most important number at 143.03. The 113, that's a little bit lower, 142.80 there. But if we're looking at that, check this out, right there at that bar, that's the bar that most most of the harmonic traders know that that's a terminal bar in terms of the execution of how do we handle this 
uh, and we look at that. We do not execute until after this is completed. That's an important concept. So those are some great and really interesting ABCD structures. And then I think this larger one that's completing right now on the daily is something that we can follow and also take a look at really nice harmonic strength index confirmation. There's a couple webinars on that on the YouTube channel and the harmonic pattern collection page. Take a look at the harmonic pattern collection for Ninja Trader. We've got lots of features and lots of ways to scan for fantastic opportunities to find the harmonic patterns that, that give us great structural signals. And then we have sophisticated confirmation strategies like harmonic strength index that helps gives us confirmation on defining which patterns have the greatest potential. So get more information about this at Harmonic Pattern Collection for HarmonicTrader.com. My name is Scott Carney. Thanks for joining me.